Okay, so our first step is to simplify. So we're going to take this negative 2 and multiply it to the x. So negative 2 times 1 is negative 2x. And then we have negative 2 times negative 5. So negative 2 times negative 5 is positive 10. Okay, so we are done simplifying. The next step is we are going to now highlight the variable term. And we want this to be all by itself. So we need to get rid of that plus 10. So we're going to subtract 10 or put a negative 10 on both sides of the equal sign. So that cancels. Negative 1 minus 10 is negative 11. And then now... Since the variable term is all by itself, the last step is to divide. So we're going to divide by the coefficient of x because by dividing, this is going to make 1x. Whatever we do to the left side, we have to do the right side. And a negative divided by a negative is a positive. So the negatives will go away because they make a positive. And then 2 can't go into 11 evenly. So we're going to leave it as a simplified fraction, so we can write our answer as 11 halves. We could also write our answer as 5 and a half, or we can write our answer as 5.5. So all three of those answers would be great.